You said Afro Beats mm-hmm. gives gives props back to to, to reggae to dance hall. Do they? <laughs> I thought I, I heard you so. say that. I don't think they do. No, I never said that. I oh, said they don't give fucking props back to dance hall and reggae. Oh, my bad. I heard it wrong. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now you really dyslexic. Yeah, yeah. I heard, my bad. I thought I heard it, heard it the other way around. But then I, then I heard you say, because I heard you say Afro Beats. I thought I heard you say that. Mm-hmm. The Afro Beats, like, you know, pay homage. The greatest musician out of Africa was Fela Kute. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fela Kute. Mm-hmm. Uh, Lucky Dube from South Africa. We had Salif Keita. We have Yusu Endor. We have Baba Mal. Now, no one wanted to go beyond the pale of what those brothers was doing. I went to Africa in 1991 and I spent like three weeks constantly at the university in Kenya? under Boabab trees. In Kenya, that's Educating people from Ghana, right. all over the continent about reggae music and dancehall. But I was happy when they came to their senses to realize that music is the, the bridge that's going to connect us. But what I was disappointed in, they didn't try to connect with Jamaica the roots. They connect with everyone else mm. except us. Uh, and you talk more Afrobeats? Yes. Okay, okay, continue. I'm sorry. So they're connected with everyone else except us. But when we look at what they're doing, their music is not free in Africa. It's far cray. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what to say. music needs to free Africa. If I am all the way in Jamaica and my, and my country and my people fight for free, you're a continent with word, sound, and power. And right. you have the ability now and all you're singing is for cray. You don't sing a song to free Africa all now. Mm. Shit. Well, me them bringing this to the forefront of your mind, but we desire more from them. Ooh, you want man. the money? Go get it. But what's going to be said about you later on and yeah. your posterity? You didn't make any impact. So, reggae music still stands predominant. It is still the king's music. Yes. <laughs> Legendary dancehall reggae artist. Buju Banton, a check like he bore off. I honestly don't know where this is coming from, but it looks like he's criticizing Afrobeats artists. To be honest, I love, love, love me some reggae, and I love, love, love me some Afrobeats, and I think they are both playing their roles in the society. I wouldn't choose one over one because my emotions place reggae when i feel like and the other place afro beats um the comment section especially on twitter is really going crazy so i don't know just let me know what you think in the comment section and don't forget this is our media like comment share subscribe Mwah.